Now let's go to set four. Number 76. An observer watching a sailing ship at sea notes that the ship appears to be sinking as it moves away. Which statement best explains the situation? So ang nakikita daw ni observer doon sa horizon po as si ship po pat, uh, patungo po it will travel towards the horizon the ship sing, seems to be sinking sabi niya or sabi ni observer ano po ang explanation po dito so from that we can see that yung uh, yung earth po natin is basically magbe-base doon kasi si earth naman meron siyang curve surface po okay curve surface may same po na question po itong question na ito at yung sagot po naman is ang earth po natin ay isang oblate spheroid. So either curved surface or oblate spheroid po si earth. 77. The true shape of the earth is best described as what? Oh, ito. Ito yung sabi ko kanina. Oblate spheroid. Okay. Ang sagot po dito is delta. Slightly oblate sphere 78 the fraction of incident sunlight reflected by a celestial object is called what okay by definition ano po si fraction of incident sunlight reflected by a celestial object ang tawag po natin sa kanya is albedo po okay albedo 79 earth moves fastest when it is closer to the sun in and slowest when it is farther away from the sun. Okay? Saan po or anong petsa po? Anong mga months po? Kapag si Earth po is nagmumove fastest when it is closer to the sun and slowest po. Pag fastest po, pinakamalapit po siya closer to the sun sa January. At saka slowest po siya, farthest po siya sa July. So January, fastest, July, slowest. Alpha. 80. Earth as a whole <clears throat> receives the most solar energy during what, what, what month? Okay? What month po yung si Earth po is pinakamalapit? Na-mention na po, na-mention ko yan kanina, di ba? Pag malapit po, malapit si Earth sa month of January. Okay? It will receive the most solar energy at January. 81. The consistent tilt and the orientation of its axis as Earth moves around its orbit is responsible for yung tilt at saka axis. Ang lumalabas po, ang phenomenon po dyan is may magkakaroon ng seasons. Okay, bravo po, seasons. 82. The length of an Earth day is determined by the time required for approximately on what? Okay, length of the Earth day. Siyempre, length of the Earth day, day and night. Diba? Day and night, Earth's rotation. Okay, Earth's rotation. Pag year po, Earth's revolution. 83. The apparent rising and setting of the sun as viewed from the Earth is caused by what? Okay, rising and setting of the sun. Meaning to say, day and night pa rin. Anong day and night? Earth's rotation. Delta. 83. Four. During the course of a year, a relative to the sun, and relative to the sun, Earth's axis points toward towards what? Okay. During the course of the year, relative to the sun, ang Earth's axis down nagpo point towards sa ano? Okay. Yung Earth's axis po during the course of the year, it will point towards the sun half of the year and away from the sun the other half. Iba siyempre nagro rotate naman si Earth. At saka yung revolution is changing po siya. Kaya meron tayong mga seasons. Apat po. Kaya towards the sun, half of the year. Away from the sun, half of the year. 85. In summer, we see the sun rise early and set late. Bakit ganito po? Sa summer po, makikita natin si sun na nagra-rise early and nagsaset siya ng late. Paano po ito or bakit po ito? Ang reason po dito is syempre yung sun, rising rising po ni sun at setting po ni sun kay tilt po yan sa axis po ni earth towards the sun okay kasi it will tilt towards the earth meaning to say mag uh, maiiba po yung time length po ng daytime at saka nighttime 86 
Why do we see the sunrise in the east? Why do we see sunrise in the east? Always po talaga na nakikita natin si sun na nagra-rise ng east. Kasi naman yung rotation ni Earth, paano siya nagro-rotate? Si Earth, west to east ba or east to west? West to east po, okay? Si Earth nagro-rotate from west to east. Remember that one. 87 The sun appears to stop increasing or decreasing its altitude in the sky, stop then reverse its movement twice a year. Ano po ang tawag dito? Okay, si sun po daw nagsa-stop appears to stop increasing or decreasing its altitude in the sky, stop then reverse its movement twice a year. Ang tawag po natin dito is solstice po. 'Di ba? Yan po yung summer solstice at saka winter solstice. 88 At these times, Earth's axis is perpendicular to a line between the sun, center of the sun and the earth. Okay? Perpendicular to a line po. So, meaning to say, equal po yung daytime at saka nighttime. Pag equal po yung daytime at nighttime, equinox po. Okay? Equinox. 89. During the equinoxes, during the equinoxes, ano po ang nangyayari during the equinoxes? Okay? Let's try each of the options. A. A vertical stick in the equator will not cast at a shadow at noon. Siyempre, kasi equal yung daytime at nighttime. At noon, the sun is directly overhead at zero degrees latitude. Of course, kasi equal, equal din sila lahat. Daylight and nighttime are equal of length. So, ang sagot po is lahat po. All of the above are correct. Letter D, delta. 90. The focal pendulum, experimental proof of characteristics of the Earth's what? Okay? Pag focal pendulum po, yung experiment dyan is because ginagamit natin or pinuprove natin yung rotation po ni Earth. Okay? Pag focal pendulum, rotation po ni Earth. 91. In about 12,000 years, the star Vega will be the North Star. Not Polaris because of Earth's, ano po ang tawag natin dyan? Yung changing of positioning po ni Earth in about 12,000 years. Ang tawag po dyan is, meron kasi si Earth, meron siyang precession. Okay? Precession. 92. How many years it takes for the Earth to complete one turn or wobble? Ito pong tinatawag natin yung precession niya. Okay? Yung precession niya, ay hindi, hindi ito precession. Ito po yung wobble po, yung Sam Milankovitch cycle. So, how many years would it take for Earth to complete one turn or for one wobble? Okay? Ang sagot po natin dito is 26,000 years. Okay? 26,000 years. 93. It is known to be a relatively solid, small body of frozen water, carbon dioxide, ammonia, and methane, along with dust and rocky bits of materials. Okay? Anong tawag dito? Um, uh, we have key terms here. Body of frozen water, ammonia, methane, and dust and rust. Ang tawag po natin dyan, yung my tail. Yung my tail, si Comet po. Yung my tail, si Comet. 94. Area of the solar system where long period comets with orbital periods of more than 200 years originate. We are talking about long period comets. So, mga comets po na medyo matatagal bumabalik. Okay? Okay. Saan po siya makikita? Saan po? Sa outside po. Outside is si Oort Cloud po. Okay? Oort Cloud. 95. Ito naman. Pag short period comets, okay? Short period comets, sa ang area po? Yung area ni Kuiper Belt. Kuiper Belt. So, kanina, long period Oort Cloud, short period Kuiper Belt. 96. Between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter is a belt or circular region of thousands of small rocky bodies. Okay. Between daw ni Mars at Jupiter. So, siya po yung inside version po ni uh, Kuiper at si Oort Cloud. So, anong tawag sa belt na ito? Ang tawag po dito is, siyempre, si Asteroid Belt. Okay? Asteroid Belt. 97. The remnants of a comet Of comets and asteroids in space are called what? Okay, remnants po yung pinag-uusapan natin. Remnants po. So, mga comet po, always siya nag-orbit. Meron siyang mga uh, remains po. Remains after it 
after it will travel. Kaya ang remains po yan ay tinatawag natin na meteoroid. Okay? Remnants ng comets, meteoroid. 98. A small body from space that falls on the surface of Earth. Okay. Falls on the surface. Kapag yung heavenly body pumupunta kay Earth at at nahihit po si Earth sa surface niya is ang tinatawag natin dyan is meteorite. Okay? Meteorite. Kasi may rights po siya na pumasok kay Earth at mahit si Earth. Meteorite. Last two. Meteorites are classified into three basic groups according to their composition. Which of the following is not part of the group? So, meron tayong three classification of three classification groupings po sa, sa mga meteorites. Okay? Isa po sa kanila, sa option dito ay hindi po part sa group. Ang hindi po part sa group dito is yung IC meteorites. The three basic groups of meteorites are iron meteorites, stony meteorites, at iron stony. Wala pong IC meteorites. Yung IC po is kay comet po yan. Last number for this set. The most widely accepted theory on the origin of the universe. Ah, hindi universe. Solar system pala. Okay, solar system, hindi si Big Bang. Naman, Big Bang universe ito eh. So, Anong tawag dito? Yung nebular hypothesis or nebular theory or otherwise known as protoplanet nebular. Letter C, Charlie. Okay? We have finished set 4. Let's move to set 5. Click kayo dyan.